Yeah, so a good day to everyone. We are starting the series of DM lectures. Uh, the first topic which we are taking is the most lame, the most boring, the most what about the dry topic of DM, which is physical and chemical properties. Huh. So it will be a challenge, but let us see how we can take this up. The book which I am referring to is the legendary book that is Phillips. I am referring to Phillips or Indosevis, uh, the Southeast Asian edition and i'll be taking references from international also whenever there is a need so why do we need to study physical and chemical properties see when you are in a relationship pardon me for the example when you are in a relationship you need to know your partner properly so that the relationship is working perfect okay so what do i mean is with your relationship with dentistry, there will be a lot of physics in it. There will be a lot of chemistry in it and there will be some drama as well. If your physics and chemistry is not going good, trust me, you're going to have a lot of drama in dentistry and ultimately you will be leading to a divorce. <laughs> trust me for that. So talking about physical and chemical properties, uh, we must know certain things like uh, every material which we use has properties. Okay. And if you are not having a sound idea about physical and chemical properties, you will be a type of dentist who answers patients like this patient and he says, my crown dislodge ho gaya, ya fir filling dislodge ho gaya. and you'll be saying, Haan, wo ho jata hai kabhi kabar. Aapka case hai, sir. the trust me, the lamest, lamest answer to this question is Aapka case hai, sir, ya fir ho jata hai kabhi kabhi. But if you are someone who has studied DM from Prostovala, yeah, from, from Philips, uh, trust me, you are not going to answer it that way and you'll be in love with the subject. So starting with what are physical properties? So see all your physical properties, all your physical properties are based on laws of mechanics or maybe acoustics or maybe optics or maybe thermodynamics well, these are the various properties which come under physical uh, properties okay can be electricity or or socho or socho what all properties can come under physical properties or koi properties hongi magnetic yes you are very correct and yes what about you absolutely that is also a correct one radiation and yes there That's, that's really thoughtful. That's really thoughtful. Atomic structure. The audience today is fantastic. I mean, itna sab kuch mere ko lag raha pehle se bade gaya hai, hai na? Hai na? Hai na? Hai na? Okay. So see, jaise uh, laws of mechanics ho gaye, and there will be acoustics. They can be optics. Optics ke andar, for example, color comes in, which we'll be dealing in uh, in the later context of the chapter and um, thermodynamics may like thermal diffusivity thermal conductivity yes sab both abhi, these words will seem alienated to you but trust me at the end of this lecture you will be the master in all of these terms then there are something known as chemical properties what are chemical properties see chemical properties are based on ways in which substances interact combine and change as governed by the outer orbital electrons okay so being from someone coming from the background where you have studied physics chemistry biology and chemistry you are very much sure of the fact that chemistry may the reactivity reactivity is determined by the outer orbital electrons how loosely they are bound how tightly they are bound if they are loosely bound the material is going to be very reactive and if they are tightly bound the material is going to be less reactive this is something which we can say in layman's terms okay so this is something which is very important but still see 
you must understand this thing that physical and chemical properties are very very important it's like the crux of dental materials you're studying dental materials because of the fact you need to understand these and that is how this subject is very very special now to deal with this subject let me tell you certain aspects first of all to all those who are attending the live lecture as well see you need to prepare certain notebooks to deal with dental material as the subject firstly will be the definition notebook definition notebook then there will be a values notebook then there will be a composition notebook then there will be a properties and how they are affected wali notebook okay these four notebooks are paramount to study dental materials and talking about physical chemical and later mechanical properties as well definition notebook will be very very important so what i want you to do is today's homework today's homework is that the first page the first page of this chapter in d in your philips has certain definitions i want you to write those definitions in your notebook how will you write those definitions in your notebook you will first read the definition break it in parts or points learn close the notebook and then write it close the book and then write it in the notebook okay and you must 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 trouble me with doubts whenever you will be breaking the definition in points then you will be able to understand ki iska logic ban raha hai ki nahi ban raha hai and if there is no logic in it you will contact me and ask me for doubts trust me i love students who ask doubts as many doubts i feel the most intelligent student in my batches jo sabse zyada doubts puchega okay so let us continue ahead talking about the physical and chemical properties yahan par there is certain important things which i am mentioning now might not make sense here but aage ja ke they will make a lot of sense for example the property of color and thermal properties thermal diffusivity thermal conductivity lot many things so color and thermal properties are very much important for ceramics what are ceramics ceramics is a type of dental material which is an aesthetic dental material aesthetic dental material matlab it matches the shade with the tooth to aise materials ko we consider aesthetic because they appear to be very natural तो नेचुरल दिखाने के लिए हमें दांत का कलर मैच करना होगा सो कलर कम्स इन इट नाउ दिस सिरामिक इज आल्सो वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट इन द सेंस कि हमारी ओरल कैविटी में देयर आर टेम्परेचर चेंजेस सुबह कोई चाय पी रहा है दिन में कोई आइसक्रीम खा रहा है देर विल बी टेम्परेचर चेंजेस ऑल्सो द फैक्ट दैट सिरामिक को ना हम एक मेटल के ऊपर लगाते हैं मेटल सिरामिक नाम का एक क्राउन होता है जो कैप होता है वो मेटल सिरामिक का उसमें मेटल होता है उसके ऊपर सिरामिक लगता है सो so, उसके अंदर मेटल और सिरामिक का अगर टेम्परेचर चेंज मैच नहीं करा तो बहुत बड़ा प्रॉब्लम हो सकता है सोचो आप चाय पी रहे हो मेटल गर्म होने की मतलब गर्म के कांटेक्ट में आती थोड़ा सा एक्सपैंड होगा बट सिरामिक उतना एक्सपैंड नहीं हुआ तो पता है क्या होगा सिरामिक चिप टूट जाएगा ब्रेक हो जाएगा इट इज वेरी ब्रिटल मेटीरियल ब्रिटल मतलब बहुत नाजुक है एकदम से टूटता है कांच की तरह एंड इस पर्पज के लिए थर्मल प्रॉपर्टीज आर ऑल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर सिरामिक Now we talk about impression materials. ये क्या होते हैं कि वो materials होते हैं जिससे हम oral cavity का impression लेते हैं Impression means see, patient आया patient में you have to do some work. Now patient हर एक बार तो आपके पास बैठ नहीं सकता है He or she will be going back to home. आप कैसे काम करोगे उस पर So you will be creating a replica of the oral cavity with yourself सेल्फ ताकि आप उस पर काम कर सको और वो रेप्लिका लेने के लिए यू मेक यूज ऑफ इंप्रेशन मेटीरियल्स इंप्रेशन मटेरियल्स के अंदर प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ फ्लो एंड विस्कोसिटी बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट माना गया है फ्लो क्यों क्योंकि देखो आप किसी चीज का इंप्रेशन ले रहे हो मान लो आपको ये आ, इस मोबाइल का आपने इंप्रेशन लेना है तो आपने क्या करा इसके ऊपर एक मटेरियल लगाया अब ये मटेरियल यहां चिपक गया बस आपको तो सारी जगह रिकॉर्ड करना है मटीरियल साइड साइड में फ्लो भी कर गया तो अच्छी रिकॉर्डिंग आएगी 
ये छोटे छोटे कैमराज के बीच में घुस गया तो अच्छी रिकॉर्डिंग आएगी दैट इज हाउ फ्लो प्रॉपर्टी इज वेरी मच इंपॉर्टेंट कि डिटेल रिप्रोडक्शन के लिए विस्कोसिटी क्यों इंपॉर्टेंट है मान लो बहुत लेस विस्कस है बहुत थिन मटीरियल है सब जगह बह जाएगा आपने ओरल कैविटी के अंदर लगाया गले के अंदर चला गया सो दैट इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग विस्कोसिटी इंपॉर्टेंट है बहुत ज्यादा इससे ज्यादा अगर हमने पंगे लिए तो पेशेंट को बहुत अनकंफर्टेबल लगेगा ना सो फ्लो एंड विस्कोसिटी आर ऑल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट अमेलगम नाम का एक मटीरियल होता है बोलते ना दांत में लोहा भरवाया था कुछ पेशेंट्स ऐसे बोलते हैं बोलते हैं दांत में हमने लोहा भरवाया था जी सो अमेलगम इज दैट मटीरियल ठीक है मोस्टली सो अमेलगम की एक प्रॉपर्टी होती है क्रीप क्रीप का मतलब क्या होता है वो मैं आगे बताऊंगा अभी अभी नहीं बता रहा तो अमेलगम में क्रीप बहुत ज्यादा इंपॉर्टेंट होता है ऐसे ही अगर मैं मेटल्स एंड अलॉयस की बात करूं तो उसमें टार्निश एंड कोरोजन बहुत ज्यादा इंपॉर्टेंट होता है ये मैं आगे के लेक्चर्स में जरूर लूंगा ठीक है कमिंग अहेड ऑफ इट सो ये बेसिकली एक क्रक्स है जो अभी बहुत ज्यादा इंपॉर्टेंट है अब हम नेक्स्ट टॉपिक पे बढ़ेंगे विच इज रियोलॉजी ठीक है